some of the questions people are asking right now are, is it that important that I stay cooped up inside my home? Do I really need to avoid small social gatherings? Am I really that at risk? The answer is there are no answers yet. 13 on your side's Brett Ashcroft shows us how a man's interactive idea is keeping people better informed about the virus. What will life look like when we come out the other end of this health crisis? Nobody at the moment knows. A man at Calvin University is deciding to focus on the now. He's come up with a hyperlocal and interactive way to keep people better informed about the risks. COVID-19 is a little bit like a, uh, a bad horror movie with a dishonest trailer. It, it fools us into thinking that it's more innocuous than it is. All metaphors aside. This is not just a biological epidemic. It is a social problem that requires social solutions. That's why Neil Carlson. It has some very useful, powerful math in it. The that, director of Kelvin University's Center for Social Research created one. What are the odds that a meeting of a given size will actually have an infected person in the room? A coronavirus risk calculator. But right now you are taking a gamble going into a, a public space. It's on Calvin's website. You don't have to be a math scholar to use it. Right now in Kent County, we've had one reported death for 653,000 people. It doesn't sound like a lot, but when we do that math we we're talking about, for that one person who passed away, we'd estimate based on China and state of Washington's experience, there's probably over 100, maybe 115 people who were infected at the time they got infected. Load in data using the drop downs. So you can play with these estimates. You could change the population for a different area, change the number of reported deaths, and essentially do the same math to calculate what's the risk in your area or even in your company. Word of advice. Don't use this to rationalize risky behavior. That's not the intent. I, I hope that the, the calculator will serve more as uh, intel creating intelligibility about why public health officials are are recommending the steps that our governor has taken and that other states and localities are taking. In Grand Rapids, Brent Ashcroft, 13 on your side. If you would like to learn more about Kelvin's visual meeting risk calculator, check out the web version of this story on 13onyourside.com. We have embedded a link to a nine minute video tutorial. You'll also find other digital visualization tools that Kelvin's Center for Social Research has developed.